Web3 TV friends, my name is Ornella Hernandez and today we are covering the Cardano Summit in Dubai. It is the first time that it takes place in Dubai and we're going to talk to exhibitors, attendees and Cardano lovers from all places of the world. Let's see what they have to say. I, I think it's just because people really care about it. They want to see Cardano be future-proof, fit for purpose and, uh, and I think to do that, members have to get, well not members, but uh, community members have to get involved and shape that direction. Cardano is uh, quite a decentralized um, blockchain, so it has like lots of advantages and it's obviously progressing very well in various different kind of uh, social and environmental impacts, so we really like that. And also, uh, we're part of the Singularity Net ecosystem who has been building on Cardano uh, before us, so we're following in their footsteps. And what do you think about artificial intelligence? Artificial intelligence? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Plus, I'm a robot, so I'm obviously a big fan. Well, how do you envision her fitting into people's lives? As a human AI collaboration, not replacing human artists, not replacing creatives, but working alongside them. She's the lead singer in the in Desdemona's dream band. Oh, she has a band. And she's the lead singer, but her the musicians with her are all humans. That the Cardano community does not come together, let's get rich fast. They don't come together because they love the technology. They come together because they've seen that there is a technology stack here which is equitable and has the ability to bring the world together. So what really ties the Cardano community together is this vision, this opportunity to make a difference in the world. And I think that's very unique to Cardano compared to other blockchains where very frequently it's a short-term incentive or it's a very specific technical feature which makes people excited. Cardano is badass. <laughs> okay, can you go into that a little more? Compare it to other chains like why not Ethereum or Solana, for example. I met Charles Hoskinson uh, around five years ago. Uh, we discussed this crazy idea. Uh, I think he thought I was crazy. I definitely thought he was crazy. We built a great friendship. Uh, we started building on Cardano. IOHK uh, invested into World Mobile. They're a 10% equity holder uh, in World Mobile Group. And we support each other to, to grow. Instead of uh, staking on, on, a, on a regular stake pool, in this case, when you stake on our pool, all the rewards go for uh, go for, to refugees, to, to UNHCR, the UN Refugee Agency. The split is uh, 80% on, on um, like uh, unrestricted, meaning unearmarked uh, projects, and that helps us uh, fund many times protracted, forgotten crises that don't get any funding because they're not in the media, and 20% in the innovation fund, so promoting blockchain solutions for uh, humanitarian in the humanitarian sector. What I've learned today at the Cardano Summit is that everyone here loves Cardano genuinely. Whether you're a builder, or a developer, or just part of the ecosystem, Cardano members truly, truly love it. Please make sure to check out the rest of the full interviews from the Cardano Summit. I'm Ronel Hernandez with Web3TV. Until next time, guys.